Well, here we are. Uh, it's been about a week since my last update. I was out of town yesterday, and when I was out of town, some little critter took it upon themselves to completely decimate quite a few plants. Um, I'll show you that in just a moment here. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what the critter could be. Uh, it could be a small guy, but he took off the tops of my plants. Um, so I'm thinking a deer. Could be a deer. Uh, let me know what you think. But here, I'll start showing you. Come down. Gone. Now, I'm not going to show you all of them, but there's quite a few like that. Gone. Growing tips. This one still is fine. It skipped a couple plants. If I come over here, gone. Now, that's not the true devastation, but it definitely hurts. At least this one still has its growing tip. Came through and it basically pruned the outside of it for me. I don't know if I like a critter doing that for me, but All right, let me move on over to the peppers. Here are the pepper plants. Tops are just gone. That one. Down here. Just. And it didn't even touch the peppers. The peppers are fine. Well, the peppers that started to grow anyway. Top off the plant. Top off this plant. All my larger pepper plants. This guy, he did just a little bit, but he left the peppers. That plant, when he was moving through, just snapped it off at the base, so that plant is done. Top of that plant. And then the rest of my peppers here are okay. Pretty much undamaged. Didn't touch any of the kale, of course, because, you know, it's a nice cheap plant. Didn't touch the radishes, didn't touch the mustard. Didn't touch the cucumbers, which I'm surprised. But if I come back over here, my beans are just not doing so good, my string beans or my pole beans. But hold on a second. There you go. The tops of all my bush beans. See right down the row, to about there. It's about 15 feet of beans that just stripped the leaves right off of. Uh, it's heartbreaking, but you know, I'm gonna try setting up a fence here in a minute, but I already blew my garden budget. So we'll see what I can dig up. I'm just gonna restart the, all these beans from scratch. You'll see that in either the end of this video or the next video. Um, I'm down to about 10 or 15 bush bean plants that are currently intact, but this is a 25 foot row and that's not enough to justify it. And it's early enough in the season so I can restart the beans. But uh, it's just amazing. I'm just gonna walk around a little bit here for just for a second. So I'll show you, uh, here's another tomato plant, one of the ones that decimated more. Just love these things. Uh, the two pepper plants that I'm doing the comparison videos for are untouched, so that's good. And there's a couple tomato plants here that it didn't touch. But yeah, just when you think things are going pretty good, uh, nature has a way to kick you in the pants well keep on gardening and uh it can well i guess it could get worse but hopefully it won't <laughs> uh i'm gonna work on a fence here like i said i'll show that in a bit all right guys thanks for watching take care